Welcome to Connector Products installation of the Stirrup Connector Review video. In this video, we will review installation using a hot stick method. Follow the same guidelines for using the glove method in the field. The CPI Stirrup Connector is designed for connecting to aluminum or copper conductors while providing a tin-plated bale that is used to protect the mainline conductor from damage or arching when hotline clamps are connected or disconnected. These are extremely beneficial in applications that require a disconnect point. Make sure you have the approved tools for the installation. This will include gloves, conductor blankets, a standard shotgun stick, and a universal hot stick with a spring-loaded socket adapter. Check the part number and packaging to ensure the correct size connector is being used. Always prepare the conductor to your company standards. CPI recommends wire brushing 6 to 8 inches of the conductor where the connection is to be applied. If applicable, strip insulation so there is enough bare conductor to work with easily. Once the conductor is prepared, unscrew the bolt by hand to open the connector, allowing more space to work onto the conductor. Load the stirrup into the shotgun stick by pushing the bale to the closed side of the connector body. This stirrup has a double wedge action and will lock the bale during installation. You will see this later in this video. Place the connector body over the conductor at the desired location. Before releasing the hot stick, pull down on the bale and set it in the desired location that will allow maximum efficiency later. Have a partner hold or leave the shotgun stick hanging on the bale for added stability. With a second shotgun stick, load the interface. It may be easier to orient the interface tab on the short finger of the shotgun stick clamp. This will aid in removal of the stick later. Using a universal stick with spring-loaded socket attachment, tighten the bolt until the shear head shears off. Be sure to insert the socket fully covering the bolt head. Make sure socket is perpendicular to wedge face. Do not apply lateral force on the bolt head. During tightening, the bale may move slightly. As you tighten the bolt, you can readjust the bale position with your other hot stick hook. The bale will begin to tighten, so make sure this is completed and in the desired position before full installation. The top head of the bolt will shear off at approximately 150 inch pounds or 12 foot pounds of torque, which results in 3,000 pounds of force in the connection. There is no need to tighten the secondary bolt head any further. With the bale in place, you may now connect a Connector Products HTC to the bale to complete the job at hand. Remove all coverings and safety gear, and installation is now complete.